These actors were the first disabled artists to be recognized with awards after the release of their comedy film Campeones in 2018. Now they're back together again, this time on stage, performing a play called Comedy Champions. Claudia is our tutor and lives in a supervised apartment with us. We're all looking for jobs as artists. And despite the differences between being in front of a camera and the public, they're feeling at ease. It's like I'm at home. You've got to let yourself go with the talent you have and show what you know how to do here on stage. One of her castmates with 30 years of experience points out what's already obvious, the increased presence of people with disabilities in the performing arts. The stage is like an altar that magnifies everything going on in our society, and I think it's wonderful and has changed a lot. I'm convinced that more and more disabled actors will be seen. After a performance in Madrid, comedy champions will be touring all over Spain. It's not just about a specific play. The greater visibility of people with disabilities in the theatre is a consequence of public support with initiatives, such as the inclusion days that have been held for a decade, or the festival A Different Look that concluded after having achieved its goals. About 20% of the shows that the National Drama Centre premiered last season were inclusive, the most successful being Supernormales, which addresses sex in people with disabilities. It is very important to support creators and creators with disabilities, but also to generate necessary social debates, and their talent is undeniable. Inclusive plays have also arrived in Spain from Latin America, such as Hamlet by Peruvian Ciela de Ferrari.